If you want to learn how to deploy a dynamic web application on AWS using CICD pipeline and GitHub Actions, look no further than this project. In this course, you will learn how to build CICD pipeline using cutting-edge tools and cloud services like AWS, GitHub Actions, Git, GitHub, Terraform, Docker, Flyway, Amazon ECR, and ECS Pygate service. By the end of this project, you will build a 100% automated pipeline that you can use to deploy any dynamic application on AWS. And here's what we will build. A build will be triggered in the pipeline when a git commit is pushed to the GitHub repository. And in the pipeline, the first job will configure AWS credentials for GitHub Actions to access and create resources in our AWS account. The second job would deploy infrastructure in AWS using Terraform and create a VPC with public and private subnets, internet gateway, security groups, NAT gateways, application load balancer, RDS instance, IAM role, S3 bucket, record set in Route 53, request an SSL certificate to encrypt data in transit, ECS cluster, ECS tax definition, and ECS package service in auto-scaling groups. Once we have deployed the AWS infrastructure, the next job in the pipeline will start a self-hosted runner and create the Amazon ECR repository to store the Docker image for the application. The fourth job will set up Docker on the self-hosted runner, build the image for our application, and push that image into the Amazon ECR repository. Once the job is completed, the next job will export the environment variables for the Fargate containers into a file and copy the file into the Amazon S3 bucket. Parallel to this job, another job will use Flyway to migrate the SQL script for the application into the RDS database. Once the image for the application has been built and pushed into Amazon ECR and the SQL data has been migrated into RDS, the next job will terminate the self-hosted runner. In the next job, we will create a new ECS tax definition revision and the last job in the pipeline, we use the new revision of the ECS tax definition to update the ECS service, making the application available to the end users. This project will help you develop your DevOps skills and is a fantastic way to build your resume with experience working with cloud services, DevOps tools and processes such as CI-CD, GitHub Actions, AWS, Linux, Terraform, Docker, Git, GitHub, Bash scripting, data migration, and cloud security. So, if you want to learn how to deploy a dynamic web app on AWS using CI-CD pipeline and GitHub Actions, this is the right project for you. Thank you, and I'll see you in the course. Bye.